it is a requirement of joint aviation regulations that no person is to act as a flight crew member of a civil aeroplane registered to a JAA member state unless that person holds a valid license and rating complying with the requirement of joint aviation regulations flight crew licensing appropriate to the duties being performed. A student pilot is permitted to fly solo only if he has been authorised to do so by an authorised flying instructor. A JAA flight crew licence may be issued by a JAA member state or by another ICAO contracting state provided that, in this latter case, the licence is rendered valid in accordance with joint aviation regulations as contained in JAR FCL1 for a pilot of aeroplanes or JAR FCL2 for a helicopter pilot. If it is established that an applicant for or holder of a JAA licence has not met or no longer meets JAR FCL1 requirements or no longer complies with the relevant national regulations of the state of licence issue, then a JAA member state has the right to suspend or revoke any licence or rating or to limit the privileges of that licence or rating. A Joint Aviation Authorities licence is valid for a period of five years. Consequently, on or before the expiry date, printed in the licence, the licence itself must be renewed in accordance with Joint Aviation Regulations. However, as well as having its own validity period, the validity of a JAA licence is also determined by the validity of the ratings contained in the licence and by the validity of the medical certificate. For example, a pilot who holds an airline transport pilot's licence, which itself has not expired, will not be able to exercise the privileges of his licence on aircraft for which he is type rated if the type rating has expired. As a type rating is valid for one year only, you can see that a type rating needs to be revalidated several times during the period of validity of the licence itself. Similarly, an instrument rating is valid for one year only. And a medical certificate may, on an ATPL, be valid for one year or six months, depending on the age of the pilot. In conclusion then, all ratings and the medical certificate must be maintained valid in order that the licence itself remain valid. Within the five-year period of validity of a JAA licence, a national authority, referred to as the authority in JAA speech, will reissue the licence in the following circumstances. After initial issue of a rating or renewal of a rating, at the discretion of the authority when a rating is revalidated. The holder of a pilot licence who has attained the age of 60 is not permitted to act as pilot in command of an aeroplane engaged in commercial air transport work except as a member of a multi-pilot crew and provided that the other pilot has not attained the age of 60. A pilot reaching the age of 65 is not permitted to act as a pilot of an aeroplane engaged in commercial air transport. This limiting age is 60 in some member states, for example, France. Applicants for a Joint Aviation Authorities licence must complete the requirements for licence issue to the satisfaction of the National Aviation Authority of the state under whose authority the training and testing for the licence were carried out. That state, on issuing the licence, then becomes the state of licence issue. The state of licence issue is the country in which the aviation authority which authorises a person to act as a pilot is headquartered. Despite the multinational nature of the JAA, each nation's aviation authority acts under the authority of the legislature of that nation. Hence, the Civil Aviation Authority is the license issuing authority for the United Kingdom.
it is permitted for a student pilot to commence his training in one state and complete it in another state. In this case, the national aviation authorities of the states concerned will agree which state is to act as the state of license issue. If the holder of a license requires additional ratings or authorizations, in accordance with JAR FCL, these may be obtained in any JAA state and subsequently be entered in the license by the state of license issue. It is permitted for a license holder to make a request for his license to be transferred from one JAA state to another if there is an administrative need to do so. This action might be taken, for instance, if a JAA license holder changes his state of normal residency or if he takes up employment in a new state. In these cases, the new state may become the state of license issue. The state of normal residency is the state in which a pilot normally resides for at least 185 days in any year.